Uh, morning. Um, okay. Uh, my name is Kiki Filone. Kifilo Mkwe. Better known as Master K. Um, I'm a fashion designer graduate and um, I do events on the side. So the reason why you all are here is we're doing a program yeah, um, pattern making. So this is not a lecture, this is not a full course. This will only show you the ins and outs and a little bit of what happens behind the scene when it comes to uh, creating the garments that you're wearing right now. Where's your age? Uh, I'm 23. Oh, oh, to pee with 20 things. Uh, my day two has been very much productive than day one, actually. So I am pretty much enjoying myself today more than day one, I would say. Yo, how is my young? Compared to the eyes of day one. Oh, day two was more hectic than day one. Um, but drawing the patterns uh, were really, really getting me into what we're supposed to do for the rest of the journey. Ah, good Nandi, see Alena more. Isn't this right? It's a job, sorry. Day two is really interesting. We started with pattern on front borders for a skirt, front and back. So. Yeah, there's those challenges here and there, but Master K uh, has been helping us with uh, getting the right measurements and making sure that you get the borders correct. No. Yeah, enjoy. Yeah, it's nice. I've learned a lot. Plus, today we implemented what we've learned yesterday, so yeah, I quite enjoy. It's really, I can say, but then at the same time, it's fun. Right, yeah. Day two has been actually more confusing than day one because I think the more the more you get into stuff, the more the confusing they get. But then at the same time, it means they're more challenging. Which means income is, is basically it's, it's going to be the, the removal is overnight. Yes. So here they explaining which why we're using um, so as I did last week, which why we're using a flat pattern making and the principles that are used which are that manipulation added fullness and contouring so tina we wanna we're just gonna do a little bit of um, it, that manipulation now you are here right that leg folded so now we need to find the shape for this we need to get the shape yella so what you do is you hold the that leg the one that you folded here and you press here, press here, then you move this third leg to the other leg. <laughs> so, this is gonna be like this. This is what's gonna happen. So, the third leg you fold it needs to go to the third leg on the other side to go on top of the third leg, the second third leg. Like, you need to do it like this. At day four of the project, um, today we're just finishing off that manipulation. Uh, then we touched on pivotal transfer, which is another technique of transferring and moving the dart. Then we did um, two dart manipulation. Then from there, uh, they have to go research um, contouring and added fullness. So from next week, we might be touching on that, and then finishing off their drafts and doing color, then yeah.